what they do. do sitting with the crew, had to get some food. I see you looking like your dude. Had to make a move, make a move. If this content is entertaining or informative and helped you in any way, or if you have a video topic request about absolutely anything, send a donation to the Cash App or follow me on social media. Peace. Hey, it's Nate Almighty. Do me a favor. Before you watch the rest of this video, go ahead, hit that bell, man. Subscribe, man. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Peace. Hey, yo, check it, right? So... Last night I was on the phone with my ex and all that. Her name is that. Not gonna say her name, but here's a picture. Now, as you can see, she's fine. Now, um, I've been trying to talk to her about us being in a polyamorous relationship. For those of y'all who don't know what a polyamorous relationship is, it's a relationship where both people are dealing with more than one person, but there's 100% honesty on both sides and with their partners. So it's like, you and your partner know you're dealing with other people and the, the one or two other people who they dealing with, they all know, you know what I'm saying? So it's it's total honesty, total safety. Well, it should be total safety, you know what I'm saying? Um, like some, some women are into that. I want her to get into that because like, she was the last, my last attempt at being in a monogamous relationship. This was the end of last year, this was we started talking again in August. Well, let me give you a rundown. I knew her since about, since I was like 15, right? So look, the history is like this. Deb, nigga, Deb used to fuck with her friend, right? Her friend is named Erica. Now, now Erica put me in on with her best friend, which is the woman who I'm talking about. Now, this is real young, like we 15, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm a year older than her, so you know, 15, she 14. I had it like, you know, a little puppy love, boyfriend, girlfriend shit, but I was in the streets. So, you know, 15, I went to jail. I went to jail, you know what I'm saying? It, it, it ended like that, right? So, I come home from jail. I had it again for a little while, right? Then, you know, I was just running the streets, you know, you know what I'm saying? I just started having sex and stuff like that. So, I wasn't having no girlfriend like that. I mean, I was having girlfriends, but I was cheating on all of them. Because I ain't know at that time what I know now, which is the fact that, I'm a polygamous person, and one woman at a time is never going to satisfy me. It's never going to satisfy me. One woman is just not enough. No one woman has all the qualities of a woman that I need my woman to have, you know what I'm saying, which is shut up in this, fine, um, flat stomach, uh, high education, uh, good with kids. You know what I'm saying? Good cook. You know what I'm saying? Y'all yeah, know these chicks can't cook good no more. But anyways, that fell off. I went to jail. Big boy jail did my prison sentence. And then I came home again. And then I got it again. Right? When I first came home. This Now, after this time, now I smashed for the first time. So we smashed a couple times. But, you know, I I was still playing the field. Like, I, I came home with that glow. So, you know, I was running down on everything. Like... Like, my first year home, I smashed at least 50 chicks, you know what I'm saying? Like, it, she, she'd end up getting pregnant and hating me, like, if she would have kept dealing with me, you know what I'm saying? But then, I got it back. I got it back, like, the end of last year. Now, in between all that time, you know what I'm saying? I had two sons. She had a son, you know what I'm saying? Like, like I'm not in this dating single mothers like that. I definitely not making somebody else baby mother my girl, but because I knew her before she had a kid. And I know she's a high quality woman, you feel me? You feel me? She's a high quality woman. So I made her my girl, but then I realized that I cannot be in a monogamous relationship with a girl. So I had broke up with her after like two months, you know what I'm saying? She felt the way about it. We ain't talked for a little while, but maybe about a month ago, we start talking again. I hit her up randomly. She answered like on the first ring, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, when a chick answer on the first ring, and you know, chicks is always in their phone. They answer whenever they feel like it. They might not answer, they, you know what I'm saying? Like, but she picked up, and we start chopping it up again, and I'm like, I still love this girl. I love her. Like, I ain't gonna lie. Like, I, I love, I love women in general. I love all women. I love this girl. I love a couple other women, too, who are like, I love the girl who I made that video about well, I was the video where I was talking about meet my new boo, the chick from Brooklyn that live in North Carolina. She got a whole new nigga right now. You know what I'm saying? Like, 
I love her, but you know, like I wasn't trying to make her my girlfriend. So you know what I'm saying? She dubbed me and she got with like, I don't know, like her gym trainer or something. Some some lame light skinned nigga. Like I don't, I don't know, but but back to the first girl I'm talking about. I'm talking to her yesterday. I'm like, yo, listen, like we could be in a polygamous relationship, you feel me? Because initially I broke it down to her while I really had broke up with her in the first place. I told her, like, yo, listen, like, everything is fine, you're great, but it's me, you know what I'm saying? Like the monotony, the routine of me feeling like I wanna I have to call a girl every night at a certain time, or I gotta speak to a girl every night at a certain time, I gotta check in. That's just not for me. Like I'm a Pisces, I like my freedom. I like my freedom and the ability to do what I want when I want to do it. You know what I'm saying? Um, and I just, I really can't be in a serious relationship with one woman. And I don't mind a woman having something else to do, even if it's another dude, because I like my space. There's no one girl that I want to talk to every single day. Like, I don't care. I don't care if it's just a regular run of the mill girl, a quality woman that I meet out here. I don't care if it's a ratchet woman. I don't care if it's Beyonce, Rihanna, any of them. Because by the time I could get a Beyonce, or, well, not a Beyonce. Hove, don't cancel me if you watch this video. Not Beyonce, but like a Rihanna or one of them. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to be, at that point, I'm going to already be so lit where I can have a bunch of girls like that. And I'm still going to be how I am now. You feel me? So I'm breaking it down to her. I'm like, listen. You can have your other nigga. You could deal with him from time to time, you know what I'm saying? Just don't burn my head off. You know what I'm saying? Like, 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 you know, when we was dealing with each other, you know what I'm saying? We like to do the sushi thing, but we ain't gotta do the sushi thing. I throw the magnum on every time. We have our fun because I don't wanna, like, even though I love her, I don't wanna talk to no girl every single day. Like, I got things to do, you know what I'm saying? Like, I got my YouTube channel. I'm working on two more other channels, you know what I'm saying? One is gonna be some nerdy stuff. One is going to be some some black-centric stuff. And another one is going to be, you know what I'm saying, like a reaction channel. Plus, I'm working on a podcast right now, you know what I'm saying. Plus, I'm working out. I don't got time to just be checking in with a chick every single day. I like to be spontaneous. And if she hit me up at any random time, I hit her back. But I don't like feeling like, oh, it's about to be 5 o'clock. Got to check in with my girlfriend, you know what I'm saying. Like, I don't want to do that. So I've been trying to tell her, like, yo, listen, you could be my woman. And you can have whatever dude you're dealing with now. Because, like, she's dealing with some dude or whatever. You know, you know chicks, like, like a lot of them these days, they won't stress you for, they'll stress you eventually. But if you if you knocking it down and, and she's satisfied and it's consistent, she won't sweat you about being her man until it's like, you know what I'm saying? Like, they'll give you, like, 90 days before they really start sweating you. You know what I'm saying? But I'm telling her, like, yo, listen, you can have dude. You can have dude from time to time, you know what I'm saying? He ain't fuck with me. He ain't on my level. You dealing with him, but when I call you, you answer first ring. Like, you know what time it is, you know what I'm saying? Daddy. Daddy, you know what it is. You feel me? Like, I like this girl a lot, you know what I'm saying? Like, like I said, I love her. I love women in general, you know what I'm saying? Like, but I need a different type of situation. I'm trying to get her to come around, but she just not with it, you know what I'm saying? Like, so where it stands now is, is that... Is that, you know what I'm saying, I guess when we see each other, we hang out, you know what I'm saying, we might have sex, might not. It is what it is, you know what I'm saying. Um, but I personally feel like I'm, I'm not going to lie to this girl. I'm keeping it all the way G with who I am and what I want so she could tell me exactly what she want. And if we end up never having sex again, never being with each other again, but we can maintain a good friendship and still talk to each other from time to time, we could do that too, you know, because... She a cool chick. I don't mind having cool chicks that's friends that, you know what I'm saying, they hold good conversation like me and her have, you know what I'm saying? Um, they are women who I can respect because like, this is a woman I can respect. This is why I'm even making this video and putting her a picture up. I respect this girl, you feel me? Like, like I respect her a lot. But my only thing is, is that one of her is not enough. I want two of her. Am I toxic? Like, share, comment, subscribe, man. Nate Almighty.
Girl, bounce that booty like bad check. Damn, I'm attracted to that booty like magnet. Going with the fuck, niggas never gain access. Heard got brain like an A plus mad test. Pussy mad fresh, no smell. We go hotel, nigga mad. Oh well, cut him on toenail. She the prize, no bell. Kill a pussy, no bell. Butt heavy, no scale. Ride like coattail.